National Geographic has made a coloring book, Magnificent Animals, illustrated by Hairula Kaya. I hope I pronounced that correctly. I believe it is an artist from Turkey. And in this book there are all sorts of animals. And of course, I did some coloring here and there to get to know the book and I took my time with it because otherwise I will not be able to give you a proper review. As you can see, the drawings are all single-sided pages and you can take them out and I will show you. So that is really nice. The pages, uh, the drawings are very well done. I like clean ink lines and it just I want it to, uh, to look uh, Netjes, netjes, that is a Dutch word for uh, tidy, it looks tidy and that is uh, what I like in uh, color, coloring pages. Now the paper is pretty smooth and I have been doing some testing, this one for example. I started this page with Prismacolor Premier pencils and because this paper is so smooth I thought the Prismacolors actually are having a little bit of trouble to give you a smoothly blended look but eventually as more layers are added it uh, improves like over here, I think you can see that, that um, it looks much more blended. This is a Prismacolor pencil that I'm using right now. The paper is smooth, but if you are, just take some time with it. If you do that, then you you will not have uh, problems with the blending and smoothing and smoothing out the colors. I think. So let's look at the other pages. So all the pages are removable from the book. This is a lovely page as well. Beautiful, beautiful tiger. The nice thing about the drawings is that they are made by the same artist, so there is a consistency in the drawings, but they are also there are different types of drawings in here. This one is very nice as well with all the little ladybirds and the sheep. Beautiful duck. Okay, let's see, because I did some more coloring, let's see where I 
put it. The size of this book is um, like the Joanna Besford books. Oh, here is one. Here I'm working on this uh, beautiful bird of paradise. I believe that is what uh, this bird is. So I am putting more and more layers on top of each other, and uh, eventually the blending goes uh, pretty well. I did this with uh, Polychromos pencils and my Brownsville pencils. And there's another one I have been working on. This one. I've been taking my time with this uh, giraffe and uh, I think you can see very well here that um, if you take your time for the layering and keep using a light touch then you can do gorgeous uh, things in this book. Polar bear, a polar bear with uh, with a butterfly and flowers. That makes you think, don't you think? <laughs> Something with the global warming, maybe. And a cow, and a beautiful butterfly. Geese. And I think this is the end of the book. Yeah, this is the end. Here is a, a little word about uh, the illustrator. He is from uh, Turkey. He lives in Turkey. And there's another book coming, Magnificent Ocean. This is the back. So... As you can see, it is a it is a beautiful book, good quality. Quality of paper is uh, very good as well. Not as good as the latest Joanna Besford. The, the, those books have a little bit more tooth on the paper, but this is uh, not bad at all. And um, it has been. Um, you can see that there is. The work that has been done is done with care, and um, yeah, it looks good. There is only one thing, and that has something to do with the um, with the format of this book. When uh, National Geographic contacted me, to uh, they asked me to do a review. I was uh, very curious about what kind of coloring book they would uh, um, they would send me, and actually, to be honest, I had expected that there would be some sort of educational or an educational thing in the book or something that encourages the people to enjoy nature and although the, be the beautiful drawings of course invite you to color I would like to uh, 
I think National Geographic is such a beautiful organization and they have the power to encourage people not only to color wildlife, but to go out and um, see them with their own eyes. So I would love it if uh, National Geographic would make a coloring book or, or something with arts that encourages us to go outdoors. I have my uh, I have some ideas about that, so I will contact uh, National Geographic about it. Maybe uh, they can use the ideas. So, but for this book, beautiful coloring book. There is a price tag: fourteen ninety nine dollars or nineteen ninety nine. Canadian dollars and I'm sure it will be available uh, all over the world so I wish you a lot of joy with it and if you want to purchase this book you can go to the passion for pencils website and there will be an article about this review and uh, there will be links to uh, uh, to Amazon and um, then you can purchase it if you want. So, bye-bye.